driving in the area of uh, Sherwood Forest. Uh, because that's the only place I can really be at the moment. And I'm quite happy about that. I always feel quite at home. That's my radio going. I've got a radio in here. CB radio and all sorts of stuff. Um, so I'm going to be having a walk in the uh, forest to find uh, a nice suitable spot. Uh, it's a bit damp, a bit cold. Uh, it's not my favourite time of year. I really don't. Uh, I really don't enjoy this time of year at all. I know people like the colours. I'd soon see all the leaves on the trees, I think I've told you before. You know, I'd soon see nice green trees than bunches of sticks, dry sticks, you know. Um, so, I'll go and have a look, have a walk through the forest, have a little chat, and do what we do. I find myself today. <laughs> yeah, I'm there again, aren't I? Sherwood Forest. It's not bad, is it? Right. It's very quiet here. Um, love walking in Sherwood Forest, as you probably know. I think you've probably gathered that by now. I'm looking at all these dead things here. Uh, dead stuff. Trees. Bushes. All dead. Well, they're not dead. They look dead. Well, they're not dead. Um, they're, uh, what? Sleeping. I suppose it represents, represents everything in life. Not, does nothing ever die? Food for thought, isn't it? If trees and stuff don't die, and they come back. Uh, does that not mimic everything, including ourselves? Sounded a bit grim, isn't it? Really, <laughs> especially in the, the light of the of stuff that's going on at the moment. You know my thoughts about it. Uh, you know, you do know we're being lied to. And I suppose, you know, you can understand people um, for getting sort of suspicious. You know, I don't know. I don't know what it is or what it isn't. I do know what I see. I do know stuff that's before me. You know, um... It's certainly not what uh, what they're telling me. Uh, whatever it is, it's not what they're telling me. And uh, I think it's becoming apparent that there's underlying stuff. Just what I don't know. So it makes me wonder if we're ever going to see uh, life as we know it. Again, look at this. Uh, I can do this. What's that doing? That's just taking a picture, isn't it? That's really not what I want to do, is it? Look at that tree. You can see trees everywhere, but uh, some stand out more than others. It's huge, that is. Huge tree. I'll take you to um, Robin Hood's tree. Um, sometime in the uh, new year. Um, 21st is the uh, solace thing. means that the nights are drawing out again. I said to my dad, I said, uh, 21st, you know, the nights are starting to draw out. makes me feel much better. You know, knowing that, uh, you know, we're going to get uh, sun higher in the sky. And he said... Oh, yeah, all it tells me is that it's going to get colder and more horrible. 
I said, what's wrong with a bit of positivity, Dad? You know, but uh, yeah, he's like that. Will I end up like that? Probably, I'll, I'm probably getting that way now. But uh, it just makes me feel better once we've, uh, once the Earth's on a tilt again. Uh, reminding us that the Earth is round, of course. So the Earth is uh, going to be on a tilt, causing the sun to be uh, higher in the sky for us, which is going to be very, very nice. Uh, I'll tell you why I'm walking. What's that? What is that? I don't need... See, I can't turn this. I'm on my phone at the minute. I can't really turn it round. Uh, so how can I show you? You see, there, <laughs> what is that? I if it's some sort of a, it's got like, a, it's like a square thing, but it's got like a plastic, plas square plastic thing on the front. I can't walk into there because uh, it's all soggy and wet and sloppy and damp and filthy and slimy and and then and then and then. So I'm not uh, I'm not dirtying uh, my shoes uh, in there. So I'm trying to stick to the uh, the nicer parts of the uh, of the walk. But uh, I'll show you what uh, where we've come so far. Bit twin peaky, isn't it? <laughs> Don't believe it. There's some. Uh, Portable toilets up here. Drop them in here by helicopter or something. I don't know. I would normally be in Cornwall, as you well know, but because of this lock up thing, it's messed things up for me. So, if you're wondering where all my uh, Where Do I Find Myself Today videos are, that's the biggest problem. I can't really travel like I would normally be able to do, and, and I would have loved to be in Cornwall uh, again. But I can't. Um, so I'm a bit, uh, I'm a bit stuck. You know, the militia will get me at a barricade. Guys with guns will come along and uh, make me go home. You know, go home, go back to bed, naughty boy. Seems to be what the world's about at the minute, doesn't it? Being told where to be and where to. Stand there, stand there, back, 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 stand back. Step forward, step forward, sit down, put your mask on, get back in your basket. <laughs> now look, look. Think someone lives in there. People are, people are uh, living in these now, you know. I think it's a great idea. Very uh, vandal proof, aren't they? These containers. We can live in one of those, fully kitted out, fully insulated. You can have one on top of the other, upstairs, downstairs. You can have as many as you like. You can have a four-storey job. Uh, put windows in. Do them all out. Fabulous. Oh, my fingers are a bit uh, cold. Holding this phone. Uh, yeah. And there's something over there. Some sort of a. Trust it. I've got to have a look at. I've got to have a look. I hope I don't dirty my uh, best shoes in here. You know, I've got uh, pride, you know. <laughs> Let's have a look. What is this? <laughs> is that some sort of a toilet thing? I don't know. What is it? Is it meant to be? I suppose it's like a shower area or something like that. So you can come and uh, there's portable toilets there. <laughs> it's some sort of a knocked up uh, shower block. That'd be all right in summer, wouldn't it? Hey, eh? bring your portable shower. You've got one of those. It's you, you charge it up with uh, a USB cable. <laughs> yeah, and uh, stick the unit on a bucket. And then you've got your pipe and uh, 
and your shower thing and uh, hook that up pour your hot water in your bucket uh, I know you're saying where you're getting that from now I have to bring it in a flask or something <laughs> uh, if you've got hot water somehow uh, you can carry it enough there you can hook it up there and uh, in there and you can have yourself a shower in, in the forest <laughs> what what's better eh? at one with nature I love that I do, I do like this uh, sort of beanie world <laughs> uh, you know this kind of uh, hippie beanie environment cosmic man <laughs> far out so look what we got here some different trees uh, not much else it's not an awful lot to uh, sort of show you I suppose because it's just forest and I suppose once you've seen forest you've seen forest haven't you you know I don't suppose really uh, there's much to show you a different tree you know oh it's getting a bit uh, sloppy now look it's starting to get uh, wet and damp and I suppose I suppose I'll go back anyway a little bit of a chat for you wasn't it better than nothing